Hi guys, welcome back. Today we're going to be designing some really cute spring nails using the new collection, the Spring Spectacular from Lucente. Um, we're doing some spring pastel splodges with some gold foil accents. So these are really cute, nice for spring. This design works with any colours, so um, I'm choosing the new spring pastels. So I've painted my tip in Romeo and then I'm using the colour Daffodil and speckled egg. As you can see, you've got the little specks of greyish black glitter in these. This makes them perfect for creating those mini egg nails, but also for general spring designs. They're really, really gorgeous colours. So I've dispensed a little bit of speckled eggs and daffodil onto my Lucente palette and I'm now using my D3 brush. So I'm creating a little swirl here across the top half of the nail. This is totally random. You can do whatever shape you want. There is no wrong or right. But we are aiming to have a coloured splodge at the tip of the nail and a co coloured splodge at the base of the nail. So this colour is speckled eggs, which is a really nice pale pastel blue colour. And it's got that glitter accent in there, which makes it really nice and cool for spring. Great to use for Easter. But like I say, this design we're doing now, it works for any time of year. So this isn't just limited to Easter nails, but it is perfect for spring. So I'm going to pop that in and cure, and then I'm going to go on and do my swirly line across the base of the nail, leaving that lovely nude patch in the middle. So again, just a swirl, no set pattern, although I would try and match up, unless you're doing every nail different, I'd try and match up the equivalent fingers on each hand with a similar similar shape and design. So I'm just filling that in. This is daffodil. There you go. You can see the glitter really clearly in that color. It's really, really cute. So pop that in and fully cure. Then I am going to apply a coat of matte base coat. So we're applying this because we're going to use foil in this design. By applying the matte, when I pop on my line of foil gel, our foil is only going to adhere to the foil gel in the areas we want it. So I'm going to give it a little wipe here. I've just sprayed a little bit of prep solution onto my wipe to remove any more tacky layer that might be on there. So here I have just popped a little bit of foil gel on my palette and using my D3 brush, I am just going to apply lines along my swirls. Then I'm going to pop those in the lamp. Um, the timings are on the back of every bottle, but foil gel is 120 seconds, so that's twice on your 60 second cure button. I've got a tiny piece of bright gold foil here, and then I am literally going to dab that, nice and firm pressure, straight onto my foil gel swirls. As you can see, that looks amazing. I really love this look, and again, it's a very simple nail art that looks very complex and pretty, but it doesn't take too much time, which is what we like. So I'm gonna use a cotton bud and a little bit of prep solution, because as you can see, I've got a tiny bit of foil that's adhered in the middle, and I don't want that there, before I apply my top coat to this design. Shiny or matte top coat, either would look really great for this very pretty spring salon nail design. Hope you've enjoyed this, see you in the next one.